Hey, CW Apes and Biology, Mr. Kennedy here again, and uh, this little video clip is just, well, maybe to help you with how to make a notebook page in your digital notebook and link it to your stamp sheet, okay? So I've got my biology digital notebook open here, and we've been slowly adding pages to the notebook piece at a time. And I, you know, as we do it together in class, you know, sometimes kids come back later and they're like, I don't remember what I'm doing. So this video maybe will help you with all of that kind of good stuff. Okay. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm just going to walk you through the process of like adding another page to your notebook and and then adding um, a link to your stamp sheet and maybe even like putting a picture on that page um, if you want. So I'm gonna scroll over here and you can see some of the assignments that should already be in a biology notebook like the book walk page, okay? Some lecture notes pages, um, a gummy bear like lab page. And then we've got some template pages back here like this project page, lecture more lecture notes lab work um a stamp sheet page and then just like a blank piece of paper so what i'm going to do is i'm going to use this blank piece of paper to just make up kind of like a dummy assignment um and copy and paste it where i want it and then um put a link to it on the stamp sheet so anytime you're gonna copy and paste a page or you're gonna like do what i said attach it to a stamp sheet um, you're going to start with these template pages. You select the one you want, click on it like I've done here so it's highlighted in yellow over on the left. And then basically you're just going to use your keyboard and you're going to hit Control C together at the same time. Then you're going to scroll up where you want it. Like I'm going to put this right after my gummy bear lab just for the sake of argument. And you, you click your mouse over here on the left um, right where you want to put the page. So there's a line right there. Okay. Um, you have to click in between the slides to get the line. So I clicked in between the slides. I got a line. And now I'm just going to hit Control V at the same time. And that page is put in there. Okay. Now, um, these pages need to have titles. So it makes sense when you link them up. So I'm going to go up here where it says blank page. And I'm going to click on this piece of paper now over here. And I get the text box that basically is where the title goes. And you just you want to click in there until you can see a cursor. Okay, so now I can see the cursor in there, and I can make this a little bit bigger for you um, if you want. Okay, so we're going to zoom in, and now you can kind of see a little bit better, like what Mr. Kenny's doing. Now I'm going to delete all of this, okay, because I don't want it to say blank page as my title. All right, deleted all that, and I'm just going to say, um, just for the sake of argument, because, I don't know, this is a dummy page, and I just want to show you how to do this. So I'm just going to call this um, sample page okay now i don't want my title way over here on the side so i'm going to highlight it and then i'm going to use this alignment button to push it to the center so i click the little arrow and then i go center okay and um while it's highlighted i lost my highlight there i can make it bigger so i go over here to the font size and i'm just clicking the plus to make it as big as i want and like i can make it bold italicized i could color it whatever we can worry about that later. All right, so I've got a sample page. Now I'm going to use the left side of the screen to scroll up to my stamp sheet. Here's my stamp sheet, okay? I'm gonna click on that stamp sheet and then I'm gonna go to the box I want this in. Uh, I'll just say it's gonna be in box five. So I click over here on my stamp sheet into box five. Now this is still showing me there's a text box there. You don't need that. So I'm gonna delete that text box, just push delete. If yours pops up like that and make sure you get a cursor just bouncing next to the number five there. Okay, so I'm going to hit the enter key. So I jump down a line and I'm going to write sample page in that box. Okay, now um, to link this to this page I just made, all I have to do now after I've typed that is drag my cursor over the top so that it's highlighted. I'm going to go to this little link button right here. Okay, click on that. And then the computer's going to ask me, where do you want to link it? And this time I want to go to slides in this presentation. So I'm going to click slides in this presentation. And I'm going to scroll until I see the one that says sample page. There it is, sample page, which for me is slide nine. So I click on that. I click apply. And there you go. It's all linked up. Now let's assume I'm ready to put some text on that slide. Okay, so it's all linked up. So if I come back here to my sample page, OK, 
okay? Uh, my sample page has a title on it, but um, it doesn't have anything else underneath it. You'll notice I'm clicking and nothing's happening, okay? So if I wanna put something underneath the title, I have to insert either a text box or an image or something like that. So I use my insert menu and I can go insert image or I could go insert text box. If I insert a text box, okay, then um, I click that and it's gonna basically ask me where I wanna put it so I can make a box like this. Just you know, click the page where you want it, drag it, make the box, okay? And then you can um, type stuff here. Yay, okay? Um, if you want to put a picture in it instead of um, just a text box, well, then you can go insert image and it could either be on your computer, you could search the web. So I'm gonna click search the web and a little search spot comes up over here and it's gonna be Google images. So I'm just gonna say, I don't know, um, you know, like, well, we just did a gummy bear lab. So how about I do a gummy bear? Um, and I want it to be like clip art. So I'm going to do gummy bear and then I'm going to do PNG, which makes it like clip art that I can use. OK, so here's uh, the gummy bear picture that a lot of people actually use for their gummy bear lab. So I'm going to click on that and it tells me one selected and then I have to tell it to insert. So I click insert and lo and behold, um, it's dropped onto my page and I just drag it like where I want it. And there you go. OK. So that's basically how you do that. Um, if you want to know how to link something to this picture um, or anything like that, well, there's a separate video for that to kind of help explain how that process works. So that's how you make a page in your notebook, link it to your stamp sheet, um, make a text box so that you can type stuff on it or even put a picture on there. Um, hopefully this has been informative for you and will be helpful in the future. Um, I'm Mr. Kennedy and I'll see you next time.